So, so when I called Eric, it was maybe a few weeks later, you know, we, you know, it's kind of like when you're, when you're approaching a project like this, you know, it's kind of like a tattoo, you know, you, you kind of, you want to leave that leeway for the artist to be able to make it really pop. And so there was really just a few things that I really wanted to be, um, the fundamental structure behind the Keep Austin Fishing Rod. You know, basic, there was just a few basics, but they were important to me. I wanted it to be designed with long-term durability in mind. I wanted it to be a multi-purpose rod, a rod suitable for any angler, whether you're fishing freshwater or saltwater. You know, kind of the trend, you know, we see these these neon green rods, these neon yellow and neon orange and all these real bright shiny colors. Well, that's just never kind of been our, our, um, our MO. So, you know, when we started talking about it, you know, I really wanted it to just have a real classy, classic design. I didn't want it to pop. I just wanted the whole thing to be classic. But most importantly, I wanted to build a great rod at a really great price.